Determine the infinite integral of x sine 2x dx. I'm going to use integration by parts formula to solve this question. First, I have to determine u and dv. So, the first one is going to be u. Then, the rest is going to be dv. So, to find du, take the derivative of u. So, u equals x. Now I have to find the derivative. So du equals dx, which is the derivative. So to find v, we have to integrate dv. So dv is sine 2x dx. So dv equals, as we can see here, sine sine 2x dx we have to integrate it so to integrate this we have to use the integration rule so i wrote the two rules we're going to use in this formula so for this question because we have here sine we're going to use the second rule so i'm going to apply it so minus one over a, so 2 here is a so I'm gonna apply it so minus minus 1 over 2 then it says cosine so cosine ax which is a is 2 so 2x plus c Then after finding u, du, v, and dv, we can apply the integration by parts rule, which is, let's write it here. So the definite integral of u, dv, equals u, v, then minus the definite integral the infinite sorry v d u so now we can apply it on the rule so here we have so to to be easier for us to apply it on the formula i'm gonna write the given so we have u equals x as we can see here then v, which is minus 1 over 2 cosine 2x, then the u equals dx. So now I'm going to apply in the rule. So here we have I'm gonna write equals so u here we have x then v it's minus 1 over 2 cosine 2x but here we can't write the x before the number because we have to write the coefficient first so we can't just write x before the coefficient we have to put the coefficient first so it's gonna be minus 1 over 2 Then I'm going to put the x. Then I'm going to complete the rest of the v, which is cosine cosine 2x. So here we have the integral, but I have to put 1 over 2 before the integral. So we have to write the coefficient in front of the integral sign so it's gonna be 1 over 2 I'm gonna complete it down 1 over 2 then the integral then I'm gonna put C I'm gonna complete the rest so cosine 
2x dx so the last step is to integrate the second part of the answer so now i'm gonna keep the first one as it is and i'm gonna integrate this part so equals minus 1 over 2 x cosine 2x x plus half okay now I'm going to integrate this part so here I'm gonna use the first rule because it's cosine so 1 over a which is a is 2 so I'm gonna complete it down so times 1 over 2 then we have sine sine ax which is 2x as we can see here so 2x then plus c so now we're going to simplify it so how to simplify it so here i'm gonna write this as it is because we can't simplify it more than that so equals 1 over 2 x cosine 2x so here we have 1 over 2 times 1 over 2 is 1 over 4 so plus 1 over 4 and I'm gonna keep the rest as it is so sine 2x 2x plus c and now I'm gonna rearrange it so it's gonna be minus sorry I forgot to put the minus here so minus x then here we have cosine two x over two then plus here sign so here the reason we don't we don't need to write the one so I'm gonna write sign direct so sign 2x over 4 plus C so after we finish the infinite integral we should write plus c which is the constant of the integration so let's see which one is the answer so the answer is b